Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this After Effects tutorial, we are going to create this. To create this pop-up call-out chat animation, you need to have, any image file to use as profile image. Here I have imported these two image files, one for each person. I have also imported this video footage, the link for this video is provided in the description. Now let's start with creating the chat animation. Create a new composition, give a name to this composition. Here we need to set width to 800, and height to 200. Perfect. First we will create outline for our logo. Select the ellipse tool. Change fill option to, none. Change stroke to, solid color. Create the circle. Perfect. Here you can adjust the stroke width. You can set the outline color here, or you can also add fill, and set color of your choice. For this shape layer, set anchor point to center. For shape layer, press S to bring up scale. At near about 5 frames, create a keyframe for scale. At start, change scale value to 0%. Select created keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Let's add the image file to timeline. Scale it. Position at center of the outline. At 10 frames, create keyframe for scale. At distance of 2 to 3 frames, change scale value to 0%. Select created keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. You can adjust the keyframes, to increase or decrease the speed of animation. Now create a new null object. Parent shape and image layer to, null object. Here you can adjust the scale value. Or position for shape and image file. Perfect. Now let's create the chat box. Select rectangle tool. Create shape as shown. Change fill option to, solid color. Change stroke option to, none. Perfect. Here you can change the fill color of this shape layer. If you want you can change the edge of this shape layer. Here you can increase the roundness value. Perfect. For shape layer. You can adjust the position of this shape layer. For shape layer, position the anchor point to center. For shape layer, press S to bring up the scale. At 15 frames, create keyframe for scale. Come back at 7 to 8 frames, unlink the scale. Change Y axis value to 0%. Select created keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Perfect. Depending on your text layers you are going to insert, you need to set the scale value. You can increase or decrease the scale value at any time. Now let's add the text.
Here I am using, a real font. Style to regular. Here you are free to adjust the font size. For text layer, press S to bring up scale. At near about distance of 15 frames. Create keyframe for scale. At 10 frames, change scale value to 0%. Select created keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Here you can adjust the anchor point, to change animation direction or side. Let's see the preview. Perfect. Here our chat one is created. Now let's create duplicate of this composition. Open the second composition. Here we will replace this image, with another image file. Select the image, press Alt key, and drag it over to first image. This will replace the image file. Here we can move this shape, or text layer, by changing its position value, or create a null object. Parent shape and text layer to null object. For null 1 and null 2, we will change the position value. For text layer, you can change the paragraph alignment. Change the position of text layer. Similarly, you can create multiple chat composition by creating duplicate of these two compositions. Now let's see how to bring them in single composition in the form of chat. Create a new composition. Name it as chat. Set width and height to. 1920 by 1080 pixels. Add the chat composition to timeline. Create a null object. You can keep this composition at center, or you can change your position, it's up to you. I will place it here. Now parent it to null object. For null, Press P to bring up position. Add one second, create keyframe for position. Move 10 frames forward, change position value as shown. You can see the preview. Select created keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Add second composition, to the timeline. Position it below the first chat box. Place it at position where the first chat box animation ends. Let's parent the second chat box to null object. For null, create keyframe for position. Now move 10 frames forward, change position value as shown. You can see the preview. Similarly you can add, multiple chats, and create you texting or chat animation. To differentiate the chat box from one another, you can change the shape fill color. Here you can create composition, or you can drag the footage over this icon to create composition. Let's add the chat to this composition. Scale it. You can place it wherever you want. Let's see the preview.
perfect. If you want to track this call out, then watch my tutorial on how to track title for motion object, link is given in the description. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. If you like this tutorial, then make sure to like and share this video, and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you.